Hey there, it's Nicodemus from GPK.com and uh, just wanted to give everybody a quick little peek at Topps Chrome. Uh, most of you know by now these are in stores. I was lucky enough to find some at Target today on the way home. Um, yeah, pretty solid product. Um, I know there's been a lot of complaints about the price um, and it is pricey um, but at least you're getting a high quality product. So. Um, I was able to pick up 24 packs out of a gravity feed box and then I got five of the value packs. So uh, the value pack comes with three packs of cards and then uh, four atomic refractors. So and they're $9.49 for that, um, which is a pretty solid deal. The regular chrome packs here are $2.99 and come with four cards. Just a little people uh, for people that collect the wrappers. Right off the bat, there's a difference in the uh, wrappers. The gravity feed were flat, um, and the ones in the uh, value pack were foil. Other than that, I mean, aside from the serial numbers and stuff, there's no difference. It's much easier to read the uh, the odds on the one from the gravity feed as opposed to the uh, foil one. Um, but yeah, so. It, it, it seems like a much better deal if you can find the value packs, hence the name, I guess. But um, So, just give you guys a quick peek at some of the stuff from the set. Um, it is the base set of OS1, and they did not change the uh, banners from the new look. So, um, any last little wish of getting the original banner on there uh, did not come true. Um, but the cards themselves are really, uh, really good quality. You can see right out of the packs here how, how thick they are. Um, I don't know if anyone had like sport flick cards growing up that were like a thicker card that were like animated. Um, these tend to be a little closer to that kind of thickness, real heavy duty cardboard. Um, I haven't touched the card fronts once yet because they are real sensitive to fingerprints and scratches so um, this is just an example of the the base card set um, same checklist um, just have a little bit of a mirrored finish to them the printing quality is really great um, and uh, the image quality uh, it tops did a really good job uh, capturing the old the old images and really cleaning them up um, my biggest complaint, I guess, is the inclusion of the Lost, well, aside from the banner, is the inclusion of the Lost GPK. Um, these really have absolutely nothing to do with Original Series 1, and some of the cards, case in point, are, are this stupidly ugly. So, um, I already have these stickers from you know, the newer series, so I don't know why they felt the need to include them in here, but they did. So... Whatever. I got almost the whole set out of the box, so at least I'm, I'm done with that. Um, the next little set or subset are the refractors um, that look real similar to the, to the base set, but they do have a mirrored border and give off a little more of a shimmer. Um, and as some of the other people have noticed on the back of the cards, um, it does say refractor printed on there. So if you're having trouble telling what you got, at least you can turn it over and... Uh, and tell and and they're kind of fun so um, then these are the ones that came in the value packs these are the atomic refractors um, that are a lot of fun they they, they kind of take away from the artwork of the the um, original image but um, pretty fun collectible something really new for garbage pail kids so um, definitely uh, not easy to miss those so and then lastly are the pencil art um, there's been some complaints about these I think they're kind of cool um, the artwork themselves leaves a little to be de desired and um, honestly it didn't transfer very well to the chrome release but um, all in all and it's still kind of cool to have some some variations some John Pound sketch work um, so um, that's what those look like. So again, um, all in all, it's a it's a pretty cool product. It it, it is pricey, um, 
but you're getting something at least it's unique it's not a checkered border re-release of the same card at least they uh, have done some uh, new things added some new technology and created a really sharp looking product so I'll have these up on gpk.com as soon as I can and I appreciate you guys stopping in good luck finding them